Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with what I melted over the last week. So I don't remember, haha, <laughs> the cats are under the table fighting. I don't remember if I posted or deleted the video of what my scent picks were and my vendor picks because I had a lot, I had to delete some things off my iPad. I was running out of space. So I think I may have deleted it. So anyways, over the last week, I melted Kimmery Ann's in VCS. So I am just going to show y'all what I went through. So the first thing is Cafe Reggio. Y'all know what this is, Cafe Mocha Marshmallow. Um, if you've followed me for any length of time, you know this is my absolute favorite coffee scent. It is just an amazing blend. It is very creamy. It's a creamy coffee. I don't get any chocolate. I know the mocha, you know, is supposed to be chocolate. I just get a creamy coffee scent. I love it. I melt it on the weekends all the time. It is my top favorite coffee scent from her. I also did a little bit of Mrs. DiMaggio's Dream, and this is Blonde Moment, Strawberry Raspberry, Guava Cotton Candy Frosting. I like this one. Um, it is a very good blend. It is nice and fruity, and that is definitely one I would, I would definitely repurchase it, that's for sure. Then I, I finished a whole bunch of stuff, so I've been trying to work through things that I needed to finish, things that I had only a couple melts left. So what do I want to do now? Um, I think, <laughs> I think I'll do the big stuff because that's what's out here. So then I did some deep slumber. Deep slumber is pink, lavender, vanilla, honey. I love the scent. It is an amazing bedtime scent. Just very, very nice and soothing. All right, then I did some beehive and that's lemon, coconut cream, butter cake, zucchini bread. I love this scent. This is an amazing blend. It is just very creamy. You definitely get the lemon, the coconut, and the zucchini bread. I did some Carnival of Souls, which is cider donuts, pumpkin cheesecake, marshmallow fireside. Carnival of Souls is a favorite of mine for fall. I have quite a bit here left and then I have a whole loaf of the pumpkin cupcake carnival of souls that I got this year and I also got a single pie slice um in this scent and so those I'm saving for next year so by the time I get through this if I finish this this year I will be probably burned out on it for the season which is fine then I did some good morning and this is fruity pebbles sugar milk and blackberries and this one's really good I got this in a d stash the girl that I bought it from she loved it and then she got pregnant and could not do cereal scents anymore I love my cereal scents so this was just about a whole loaf that she had chopped up so I was excited to get that and I also did some Fred and Wilma and this one is Fruity Pebbles Rice Krispie Treats Green Marshmallow you just get you get all those you definitely get the Fruity Pebbles you definitely get like a marshmallow scent it's an amazing blend Trying to get through the big stuff first since I, they're all sitting here. And then I did some Bluebird Cafe Dessert with Maureen O'Hara. And this one is Fresh Picked Strawberry and the Blueberry Cobbler Blackberry Jam Butter Cookies. This one's really good as well. Nice and bakery fruity at the same time. It's really nice. I think that's it for the loaves. So... Then I did some swirl, which is Mac Apple Cinnamon Glazed Donuts. I only got Mac Apple from this, but it was a beautiful apple scent. I really didn't get anything else, but it was so, so good. I'm trying to get all the VCS done together, then I'll work on Kim Ryan. So then I did some Grandma's Pearls. I just did a little, a quarter of a rose. It's marshmallow, lavender, vanilla. It's good. It's very light though. Jackie O and Margo, which is um, coconut marshmallow cream pie and marshmallow birthday cake. No, I have one. Left. That's why I started laughing when I pulled this out because there's just one left. I've been trying to melt through everything so I didn't have just this one left. So, anyways, this is good. I love it. Um, I'm really loving blending things with Margo. I really love the Jackie O with Margo, the Cookie Monster with Margo, and then To Catch a Thief with Margo. So those are those are going really well. All right, so the next thing I have is Bourbon's Orleans Hotel, and this one is Cider Lane Pumpkin Cupcake Marshmallow Birthday Cake Noel. This is really good. I really love this scent. It is very, very nice. It is very fall-like, though. It's not fall here, though. It is still hot as fuck, so. Five families. Grandma, 
And this one is sugar cookies, whipped cream, birthday cake, vanilla wafers, cannolis, and marshmallow lavender vanilla. I have a bunch of this. I have like two partial loaves and then I have this. So I was trying to melt through this. I melted this a couple times. It's really good though. Very soothing. And I think, all right, so this is the last, no, it's not. <laughs> I'm a jeans lavender supreme. Again, I have one left. Lavender orange smoothie. This one is a little over two years old. So this one will be put up to melt ASAP. Big brown bag. And this one is salted caramel, eggnog, marshmallow, birthday cake, vanilla bean noel. This is really good. It was on the lighter side, but it was still good. All right, so that is it for what I didn't finish for VCS. Now into what I didn't finish from Camry Ann's. I did some Cider Lane Cinnamon Sugar Donuts Vanilla Bean Noel types. I love, love, love the scent. So what I did is I chopped, I chopped these and then I discovered that they got too soft when I chopped them. So I'll show you what I did with the remainder after. Um, this is good. I melted a whole chunk of this last, uh, last fall and I loved it so much I bought two more for this fall. So um, I have this one and I have a whole nother one, but this is such a good scent. So then what I started doing is just chopping off a piece at a time. So this one is a fluffy pink candy type cotton candy jelly donuts. Now on cold, I hate this. Um, but then when I, I actually melted it and it smells really good. So um, definitely melt through your wax before you make a decision on whether or not you want it. The next one's pink sugar flannel sheets type. This is just a nice pink sugar laundry. Your standard pink sugar laundry, really good. Absolutely loved it. And the last thing that I didn't finish, and I have a bag of stuff I finished, was rosemary mint spearmint vanilla bean noel. Now this, I am ordering the minute I can afford to do another customs round with her. I'm getting like three of these. This is absolutely amazing. Um, spearmint and rosemary mint together. Oh man. And then that vanilla bean Noel just makes it creamy, but it is mint paradise. This is beautiful. So I love that one. So now into what I actually finished. So I finished lemon poppy seed Jackio. I have a whole nother loaf coming. I bought in a D stash. So I was okay finishing this up. Lemon poppy seed marshmallow birthday cake Noel. Amazing. It's, it reminds me a lot of princess of Monaco. It has similar notes, you know, it's got the lemon and the marshmallow and all that. So it does remind me on warm of Princess of Monaco, but it is a little bit different. You are my lucky star. And this is lemon curd buttercream. This, I just had one little piece left. So I finished that up. Cape Cod. And this one's salty sea spray, sea weather driftwood water lily. This one I loved. I did it in the bathroom. It was some teddy shapes. I cut them in half, did each one in the bathroom. And then from Kimmer Ann's, I did a, I did a, I melted this whole one this week of Blonde Moment. Um, Blonde Moment is beautiful. It is just a very nice fruity blend. I melted this in every room of my house. I did it in the kitchen when I was cooking meat. I did it in the bathroom. I did it in the office and dining room. I just did it everywhere. It was beautiful. And last, but definitely not least, this was a, f a favorite, a surprise favorite, Black Cobbler vanilla ice cream shaving cream so it's blackberry cobbler vanilla ice cream and shaving cream I did not think those were going to go together with the shaving cream but oh my god this was absolutely amazing I can't I this I started out with this whole chunky last uh Monday so it was four and a half ounces and I melted through this entire thing this week alone because it was so good so that's everything I went through um, I tried to finish up some things and I tried to melt through some older things and whatnot. So I will be back with another video with my scent picks for this coming week and I will talk to y'all later. Have a great day. Bye.